Hey, what's up guys? Today, I'm going to be trying out Elden Ring. I'm going into this with little knowledge. I only watched gameplay and edits, I swear. But before I forget, run that intro. The reasons why I wanted to play Elden Ring was because I have friends and family members who told me to try it out. So here I am, and I'm like how hard can Elden Ring be? What'd you say? I wonder what class one should choose. What also sucks is I don't know what most of the stats do. You know what I'll go bandit. I like the rogue look they have, and their mask looks cool to me. Let's start on my character now. I wonder what all this stuff does. You know what I'll leave this for last. Okay, I finished him. Named him after yours truly. Queen Marika the Eternal is nowhere to be found. And in the night of the Black Knives, Godwin the Golden was first to perish. Soon, Marika's offspring, demigods all, Claimed the shards of the Elden Ring. The mad taint of their newfound strength triggered the shattering. A war from which no lord arose. A war leading to abandonment by the greater will. Oh, rise now, ye tarnished, ye dead who yet live. The call of long lost grace speaks to us all. Horalu, chieftain of the Badlands, the ever brilliant Gold Mask. Fear, the deathbed companion. A loathsome dung eater. And Sir Gideon Othnia. The all knowing. And one 
father, whom grace would again bless. A tarnished of no renown. Cross the fog to the lands between. Stand before the Elden Ring and become the Elden Lord. Where am I at? It looks like church, but for Edge Lords only. Wait, you can leave messages for other players. Also sorry for the camera moving all over. My look stick has stick drift. How did they die in a lock room? How are they dying in a locked room? See. This place is on lockdown. So, how did they die in a locked room? This looks awesome, but what's the yellow fog for? So this is where the video ends. JK, like I said, how hard can Elden Ring be? Where did the boss music come from? Oh no, what's that?
Don't worry, Torrent. Fortune is on his side. We found him here, after all. One of his kind is sure to seek the Elden Ring. Even if it does violate the Golden Order. So now they give us heals. Oh! This is the true tutorial. So this game has no fall damage like Apex Legends. If you block like a bitch, then you die like a bitch. I think that was a bar.
The stick drift sucks. I did it first try. I did it! A stance break! Oh, so this is just a checkpoint to a boss room. Like I said, how hard can Elden Ring be? I wish I took the key. Yo, I can get my friends to help me if I'm lost.
I want to see if the pots have anything. Editor play some new world discovering music. between for the Elden Ring? Hmm? Of course you have. No shame in it. Unfortunately for you, however, you are maidenless. What? Without guidance, without the strength of runes, and without an invitation to the round table hold, you are fated, it seems, to die in obscurity. That's for the comment, pal. Oh, is that a mini-boss? Let me cook this boss real quick. I want revenge. I will not continue the game until I do.
You know what? Let's just call it a draw for now. Luckily for you, however, there is one shining ray of hope for even the maidenless. Okay, when I get the chance, I'll take you out with no hesitation. Take care to listen. Are you familiar with grace? The golden light that gives life to you tarnished. You may also behold its golden rays pointing in a particular direction at times. That is the guidance of grace, a path that a tarnished must travel. Hmm, indeed. Grace's guidance holds the answers. It will lead you tarnished to the path you are meant to follow, even if it leads you to your grave. Let's just sneak by this guy. Tarnished. I can see it, but I can also see that you're not after my throat. Then why not purchase a little something? I am Kale, purveyor of fine goods. I am of a nomadic people, selling wares as I travel. The land has been tainted by madness since the shattering of the Elden Ring. It's only tarnished, like yourself, who keep things from drying up entirely. Let's say you're a very welcome customer. You know, if you can spare the rooms, you should buy yourself a crafting kit. A crafting kit allows you to make basic items on your own. Essential, really, if you intend to survive out here for any duration. The kit costs a bundle, and I admit, I do take my cut. But the important thing is that you survive. Every custom accounts, after all. Goodbye, for now. Is this a map piece or maybe a weapon? I don't know, but let's check it out. I like sneaking now. Let's do some more. I found this cave right next to the guy I just sneaked.
Time to lock in. Editor hit that time skip. Later. Greetings, traveler from beyond the fog. I am Melina. I offer you an accord. Have you heard of the Finger Maidens? They serve the Two Fingers, offering guidance and aid to the Tarnished. But you, I am afraid, are Maidenless. What's up with everyone calling me out? I can play the role of Maiden. Oh, never mind, I'll let you continue. Turning runes into strength to aid you in your search for the Elden Ring. What's the catch? There's always a catch. You need only take me with you. I knew it. To the foot of the Erd Tree. But honestly, I say deal. Then it's settled. Summon me by grace to turn runes into strength. Is that a bar? Ah, another matter. I bequeath to you this ring. Rematch with the Tree Sentinel, now. Later. Run them hands, Midas on a horse. <laughs> Never mind. To traverse great distances. It will summon a spectral steed named Torrent. Torrent has chosen you. Treat him with respect. Shall I turn your runes to strength? Let my hand rest upon you. For but a moment, share them with me. Your thoughts, your ambitions, the principles you would follow. Comment, what's a good build for me? Why do I do less damage with the sword than my dagger? Like check it. 70 damage difference, I wonder why. I'll find out why later though. Let's go shopping real quick. 
want you... Well, you're back. Care to buy something? Goodbye. Nice to do business. Round two with the Tree Sentinel, now. Later. I think I need to level up a little more. This way, Tarnished. May I have a word? Who are you? Did she knock out our boy, the shopkeeper? A pleasure to meet thee, Tarnished. I am the witch, Rena. I'd heard tell of a tarnished hurtling about atop a spectral steed. And upon looking into the matter, the talk, I surmise, is of thee. Thou art possessed of the power, no? To call forth a spectral steed named Torrent. Ah, as I had hoped, I was entrusted this for thee, by Torrent's former master. Tis a bell for calling forth spirits. Summon them with it. From ash and return to the earth tree, the spirits will obey thine command but briefly. As they recall battles past, now it is thine to do with as thou wishest. Forgive mine intrusion tarnished. I doubt we shall again meet. But all the same, learn well the lands between. How long will it be, I wonder, before the tarnished tire of obeisance to the two fingers? One, what just happened and two, can I jump bosses now? him divine dog. The fact that the jumper getting jumped is wild.
No, my divine dogs. Later. Yes, the power of summons compel you. A few moments later. Comment down below what's a good build for me, because I don't know what I'm doing honestly. Attention all viewers, did you know that only a small percentage of you who watch my videos are subscribed? So why not subscribe for future content like this? Also our new subscriber goal is 1.5 thousand subscribers. So why not subscribe to help us reach our goal? And if you want more Elden Ring content, then comment down below. So that's all folks. Thanks for watching.